Now let's introduce the concept of a light motif. First of all, a little bit of a recap. What is a motif? A motif is a small musical idea that does not represent something in a narrative. What's a theme? A theme is a complete musical idea. So think of Beethoven's fifth, where you have the motif. And that gets developed into the theme. Now, a light motif is a little bit different. It's the idea that a musical idea represents something concrete in a narrative, something specific. So if you were to think of Peter and the Wolf, where you have a story that's told with every single character represented by an instrument, you'll have a violin playing Peter, you'll have the cat having an instrument, you have the duck with an instrument, you have the grandfather with a specific instrument. Now, a leitmotif came from William Richard Wagner, who came up with this idea because he believed in Gesamtkunstwerk, which is combining musical elements together to create something bigger than its individual parts. And he had these operas where everything he wanted to micromanage, every single action, all the characters on stage, they all had to have their own musical ideas. And what came out of this is that we can assign different characters, different actions, different places, events, their own musical concept. So let's think of the film Close Encounters, where you have this musical idea that's shown throughout the film and you understand what the meaning is by the end of the film, it means hello. But the idea of the music has its own specific meaning behind it. The meaning is hello. And when you see these notes, you realize what the meaning of the music is over time. So this is what your leitmotif is. It has a concrete, specific meaning. Now let's think about some other examples. Let's think about the Darth Vader theme. Every time you see Darth Vader, you hear these notes, you know it's Darth Vader. There's a specific meaning behind it. Every time you hear these notes, you know what the character is going to be on stage. It's going to be Darth Vader. The model might be too close to the system. He, he felt surprised, was wiser. He is as clumsy as he is. <laughs> we would be honored if you would join us. I. I'm your father. No. No. It's not true. That's impossible. Search your feelings. You know it to be true. No! No! Once again, a leitmotif is a musical idea that represents something concrete in a narrative, and it's a way to tell the story through sound. Okay, so we have our motif, we have our theme, and we have our leitmotif. What do I do with this information? Well, let's think about what's going to happen to you. Someone's going to come to you and they're going to say, I have this film, and I have this video game, and make a soundtrack for me. And then they're going to expect you to be able to know what to do with that information. And your job is to take that and to come up with pieces that you can put together into a soundtrack. And in the beginning, it might feel like an overwhelming burden because you're not sure how everything is going to come together, but you have some tools at your disposal. And this is one of those tools that you're going to have available to you. You can say, I have these characters, these events, these actions that are happening in the film or video game and I'm going to associate them with some kind of sound. And then you can come up with this list of leitmotifs that you're going to come up with. One for this character, one for this scene, one for this environment, this event. And you can keep reusing those elements every time you come back to them in the story of the film or the video game. 
So rather than thinking of it as a great massive chunk of information, you can think of it as individual pieces that you are going to be scoring for. And this is one of those tools that you can use. You can break it up into different motifs and themes and like motifs. And you can keep using these throughout the story. And each time you use them, they might have a little bit different meaning depending on what's going on for the viewer at the time. If some kind of action is slightly different, but you're playing the same music, it might have different meaning associated with it. But this is how you can come up with a soundtrack. It's just by breaking it up into individual pieces, such as one of these tools of a motif, theme, and leitmotif. And you can use these throughout your story to build a full soundtrack.